Hey Super Gamers, it's Super Effective here. For this Hunter's Log, I'm going to review and share my thoughts on the four new revealed Hunters. They are due to release alongside the fourth monster, Behemoth, on March 31st, which will also include the balance changes. First up is Torvald, the Assault. He is a cyborg seeking revenge on the monsters who tore his body to shreds. Now rebuilt with deadly cybernetic implants, he will be able to help his team in a different way. Torvald's back-mounted mortar cannons can deal long-range splash damage. Once he gets closer, he can toss his shrapnel grenade to create weak points on the monster. Then to top it off, he can use his auto-fire shotgun to lay on the pain. Next up is Crow the Trapper, who was looking for a solitary life on Sheer. That was until the monster showed up to cut his retirement short. He has his pet bat ray, called Gobi, who will fly forward in line of sight for about 100 meters and then return, revealing all wildlife and monsters during its trip. Crow has a stasis gun, which when fired rapidly will slow down the monster. Or he can charge up a more powerful shot, which will slow the monster down even further and for longer. And finally, he has his kinetic long rifle, which when fired rapidly is his main source of damage. Or he can charge up a shot, which will ignore the monster's armor completely. Next is the Medic Slim, who is a combat medic that had his DNA spliced with an insect during the Mutagen Wars. His primary method of healing is his heal burst, which has a larger radius. However, he also has a leech gun, which will both weaken the monster and shorten the cooldown of his heal burst. He also has a little insect drone that will fly around and heal teammates so long as they're not being attacked. And finally, Slim can launch a spore cloud, which will mask friendlies from being smelled by the monster. And finally, we have Sunny the Support, who worked with Abe and Parnell as an ace pilot and engineer. First, she has some shield drones which can take some hits for her fellow teammates. She also has a jetpack booster that will allow a targeted teammate to fly further and faster without running out of fuel. And finally, she has a mini nuke grenade launcher as her only source of damage. Out of these four new hunters, Sunny is my most favorite because she suits my gameplay style of dealing big damage while being able to save your teammates in a pinch. My second favorite might be Slim because I like that he can deal damage while being able to heal at the same time. And his Spore Cloud acts like a pseudo cloak which can be very helpful for teammates. Now even though I enjoy being a trapper, I'm not sure how I feel about Crow. His Bat Ray is cool, but his dual weapon modes seem kind of pointless because I feel like I'm always going to favor the charge shot over the non-charged. And Torvald is my least favorite because it doesn't suit my playstyle. But he is the only hunter who can take advantage of his own weak points. So what do you guys think? Do you like these hunters? Or are you more excited to play Behemoth? Leave your comments below and I'll see you guys next time. I'm going to damage amplify him. We're gonna give you more damage. Through the wall! Look at that shit! Hey, thanks for watching, and I hope you enjoyed that episode. If you'd like to support the channel, please visit my Patreon page. 
your contributions would be greatly appreciated. Feel free to like, subscribe, share, and leave comments down below as I take all constructive feedback seriously. And if you're interested in watching live gameplay, I stream nightly on my Twitch channel. Special thanks goes out to Andrew for being my very first Patreon pledger.